One, two, three! Yeah! Today is June 8th and we're heading out to Clarendon. We're on a four path. What are we doing today? We're going to build a school. My family has a charity that's really started by Christina called Kind Arts. And we started out building houses for the less fortunate. But then Christina said, you know, how can we make more of an impact on multiple people? And that's when she got in contact with Food for the Poor. And they have this initiative where you build a basic school. Instead of helping one person, they're helping the entire community for generations to come. So, so far today, we've built seven schools across the island under this initiative. And today, we're building our eighth. So, spot forward as we go to build, isn't it? Guys, <coughs> forgot to do a quick introduction. So, guess what? This is my girlfriend. Hi, squad. Redo that is Wagwan Squad. Come on, Wagwan Squad. Wagwan Squad. I had to force her to be in the vlog. She was like, I don't want to be a big guy in the scene. Oh my god. So I had to set up the camera and start to record it. Mm -hmm. We're there now. We'll reach a car now off the highway. We'll go up a um, four path. I used to have a lift, but it's still kind of there, so I can't really say. Four paths. Four paths. How do you say it? Four paths? Four paths. Four paths. Four paths. Am I saying it right? Four paths. Four paths. Did yeah, I say it right? Kind of. Yeah, but you said it in slow. Yeah. Yo, watch the man. Yeah, all right. Four paths. We met because she actually, she's a fan of the vlog and she DM me. And she was like, yo, let me buy you a drink. I said, miss, I don't drink, but if you want to go and have a walk up, I'm down. So that was a fucking lie. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, squad, comment down below if you think she asked me out or I asked her out. Let's see who's right. Oh my god, we're holding on. Final joint. <laughs> That's what we were waiting on. We're at a GLP area. Show up! Show, show, show. Just remember, 20, 2045, James will run for president, prime minister. By then, I'll have my own money, so I'm not gonna rob you guys. Bro, please don't vote today. It's gonna make f***ing Friday's mandatory public holiday for vlogging. Guys, yo, what if I was the first prime minister that vlog my day so you know that I'm actually working for you and people? And we could vote in policies on YouTube. Dog. I think we have it. <laughs> and guys, we are here. Why is the school built already? <laughs> what the f? Alright, squad, <laughs> big up. We're going to work. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we're here with Christina, the founder and president of Kind Arts. Uh, she said build school and educate the children. Then. So, Tina, tell us more about the program. Good morning! or sorry, Wagwan Squad. We're here in Brixton Hill Primary School, which is up there, and we are building the Brixton Hill Basic School. So we're partnering again with Food for the Poor. This is our eighth basic school that we have built, and I think it's our fifth parish. This school is going to house between 80 and 90 students between the ages of four and six. Obviously, there's no basic school in this community, so we're gonna be helping, uh, you know, a make a big impact in the lives of some kids and I uh, hope you have fun watching us look like clowns today because we are clearly not experts at construction but we're experts at love. All right guys so it's our eighth school Six in the I can't say those THs you know that but okay let's ask the next question then. Christina why did you get into schools and why did you bring the family to this side we you know we started out in houses. Why do we do this? What's the, what do you think is the biggest impact of schools? Well, as we were growing up, our grandparents and our mother always said to us, to whom much is given, much is expected. So we know we're just trying to do our part to give back and better the lives of those who are less fortunate than us. And schools have, you know, a very, very large, long-lasting impact, a generational impact. So it's not like this is gonna help one family, it's gonna help many, many, many families over many, many years. 
Yo, Visa is actually not too bad. So guys, that's actually the um, primary school. Yo, nobody wants a water. Yeah, man. Ah, uh, guys, you see? I have a job, I have a job. Hi, I'm Marsha Rose, Development Marketing Manager at Food for the Poor Jamaica. Come on! We are here building a school with an amazing family, kind heart, and we are so grateful for this contribution. I know a lot of persons used to me building houses. So this is my first school. Really? Yes, yes. And this is under the Build Back the Love for Jamaica campaign. Build Back the Love for Jamaica, it's about just getting person re-engaged with Jamaica, falling in love back with Jamaica. No matter what you hear, it's still beautiful here. We still have beautiful people here. We still have the heart of gold here. And we are still making our name abroad. But we need partners to join with us, like these beautiful persons here, to make a difference. And so, as we build back the love for Jamaica, we want you to join with Food for the Poor and so you yourself can have an impact on those who are in need. Yes, you heard it here. I'm going to find out from her how we can get a link to donate or to come to www.foodforthepoorja.org All right, see that? Yes, donate, help out, come join in a build. I mean, it's really fun to give him back like Let's go. Guys, they're going to put Christine on TV right now. She said she's not feeling too Hair's cute. not done, makeup's not done. Sad. It's fine, but this is for the people. So guys, I'm going to show you more of what's going on inside the school. So guys, I'm over money labor now. I just, I did a filming. I did a filming and hunting. Oh dear. All right, have fun. So now guys, we're going actually through the school. You can see that it's just a shell right now and there's not much to it. But it will all be done in a few in in a few days, 48 hours. Hi Anna. You know we're putting out the windows over here. Are you helping? Yeah, I'm passing the wood. Okay, good job Anna. We're very proud of you. So guys, like I said, this school will hold 80 to 90 students at a time and it's a basic school so these are the youngest kids who can enter school and as Tina said the area actually doesn't have any basic school at all just a primary so this is very needed in the community yeah Lauren's so tall she can get all the high places I can reach Hi Lauren. Hi James. How's it going? Good. We're giving back. We're building a school. This is Katie and she works with Food for the Poor. Hi. How are you doing? I'm great. Lauren has the whole team working hard. Woo! I'll get the highest one. Alright, that's teamwork. Wow. <laughs> Look at the couple. Look at the happy couple. Wow. Watch love. <laughs> Do, hey. Look at that! Oh my god! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> well, we got all of that to do, baby. Go for Smell the 
a failure. But guys, they make it really easy for us to do a lot of things like you have these lines drawn on. And so you just come on along the line. All right, so guys, Nick is just hammering the wood. I'm beating wood. Oh, I <laughs> How everybody else share, but you get your own a bucket. I'm the queen. <laughs> That's why I work? That's what you do. Oh my, look at me say so. This is why he works smart and not harder. No bag of idiot. Oh, me say so. Up in a chair. Yeah, man, where from? Spanish. Where in here? Where in And you work for a fool for the poor? How long now? More 15 years. How much school you build? Yeah. All right, respect you now. I appreciate yeah, that. A man like you build Jamaica, you know. Bro, why can you not reach the top of the roller? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, James, you're going to f***ing Hi, babe. Oh, my. Look at my feet. They destroyed it. You love it, eh? Oh, my God. Show them the bro. Oh, my God. What is that? Oh, my God. What is that? You ready? Okay, you're doing great. I know. I just wanted to be with me. I miss you. You do? You can come off easy, right? Yeah. Yo, yeah. Yo, you're sweating. I you're know. working hard. Working. You are. You've done more work than me. Hey. What? I like You like painting? I like giving back. Yeah, I like giving back. Jackie, yeah. what is it? Get on what? You're growing up, you forgot? No. You're gonna turn the big three o shortly. So no more FGBG. Woo! What? <laughs> no! God, please, no! 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 Well gone guys, so the day is coming to a close. We're nearly done. So I'm going on the road to find a little shop. I'm going to buy a bottle of rum for the man them. Have a one drew to them after. Chop some shit and then back home, back here tomorrow, finish up. Let's go. Well gone squad. So we do it, you know, we give back, you know, mock over there, you know. How much, how much have you done with us? All of them. All of them, so it's eight schools. Yeah, and I've been with the building process from, we started doing houses, yeah. right, in Mobe. Mobe, yeah. Yeah. Four houses in Mobe, yep. eight schools, one hospital ward, and we're not stop. Uh, we're not stop. Down. I said, it's a real uh, jungle, but it's a jungle, but it's a jungle, but it's a jungle. When grandma said, then come, mm. grass, I best this a chicken, then get. Mm. More? Yes, thank you. No, you don't. My junk, I'm junk already. Yeah, my internet. <laughs> Respect. Every time. Man, Yeah, it's fun them and work hard. So I've bought some rum and things for them. Let them just go and enjoy themselves after. Big up food for the poor, big up money. Really, really, really full, full rating. Now you build Jamaica and now we live in. Love it. Thank you. All right, squad. So me and Richie did a grand total of all. Yo, listen. I can't Smart. get pump on prison. Yo, listen. The next man of the girl where you're missing. Stay far from war, that's a cup of lead. You can't get head when you're dead. Real talk? The food, the shit, the bed of concrete. I'm so naughty. <laughs> Anyways, real talk. It's better we come here, provide donations, than to actually work the car. The craziest, the craziest thing about the school building thing was corporate folk that work in offices. We don't come in on the morning hold on, and hold start on. hammer nail, right? Hold on. Right here, Miguel, replay, Richie hammering and the guy hammering. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Failure! Bro, first of all, I do I lick everything but the nail, you know. It's kinda gay. By the time lunchtime come around and the whole way there I eat, brother we look, two twos, the school is up in a bro. Guys, I don't know, I love it. I love hanging out with them, I love talking to everybody, getting to know the kids. So I just which is right, we really slow them down. What is nice, it's nice to be involved and just get to know everybody. Yeah, that's it. that's I agree with James. That's the that's the part I think our family really enjoys is the communicating with people and meeting people and seeing like this like on the Sunday when we do the handover is like the, the most Tomorrow. rewarding thing ever. Yes. Because you see like these kids with the brightest smiles on their faces and you're giving them something that they probably never thought they would have gotten or their families were dying for 
and it's just a very nice feeling to see like tangible things that you give back to the community. You know, I like to get to know as much people as possible because when I run for Prime Minister 2045, I need you guys to know who I am and what I stand for. I'm going to be his running partner. Yeah, I'm going to go I'm going to be the new Minister for Sport. Yeah, that would be good. Culture and Education. Sport, Culture and Education. Um, I am going to revitalize sports in our beautiful island. Pro and sports alone, you know, what also kills me is how the government has just ignored and killed our culture. Not monetized by the country or the people. We don't grow it. And so we're just left behind. Dance should have blown up way, way before bro, Afro weeks. Bro, Jamaica, honestly, <coughs> might be the most talented country per capita in the world. I, I have never seen such a small country have so many star athletes. And it's not even like not even a one man a play in the MLS. We have but we have ballers, track stars, cricketers, oh, not, swimmers, not, we all have horse riders. And a sport alone, you know, like, look at Bob Marley, They're from Jamaica, impact the world, where even after his death, years and years later, people are quoting him, buying his music, buying his t-shirts, it's only like, we are the impact of nation. Well, how much schools have you helped us build? How much schools have you done? I've done a hospital, so that makes sense. Why did they use your head as a paintbrush? You good? Yeah, no. Hey, Caroline. Can you tell them what we're going to OK, well, I guess Max will tell them. Boom it. Boom. Wagon, wagon. Top lodge. Top lodge. Right merch. Hey guys, if we do enough merch, we can get a point where 50% of all merch goes to Kind Arts. So, you know, support the dream. Rated for again, I think up to category three. I carry a lot more than that. So I've watched a professional day like three times and it's in no setting, but I don't want to mess it up. So you see me setting first. Okay, so I found them doing nothing. Expression of celebration 
dedication, and cooperation. That is it. Pray with me to the God whom I serve. The church is God. Only God that I know. Help me to pray at this time. Let us pray. White hat and white shirt and his black jeans pants. Yes, that's our member of parliament, you know. Yes, Mr. Robert Morgan. Of course, our regional director, Mr. Barrington Richardson, is also here. But that's why I said everybody is so very, very important this evening. And of course, our sponsors are all here. Now we have donors like Miss Christina Hudson, who is the director of the Kind Arts Richard and Diana Stewart Foundation. Is she here? Yeah. All right. She's here. We have family members, including Jacqueline Leacher. Yeah. Letcher. Lecla. Lecker. Timothy Stewart. Richard, Amanda, Issa, James. All those persons are here? Yeah. Yeah, the whole yard there. Yeah. Let them wave. Let them wave. Yes. This is a milestone that I'm very proud of. So for those of you who don't know me, my name is Christina Hudson, and I'm the co-founder and chairperson of the Kind Hearts Foundation. Kind Hearts was founded as a branch of the Richard and Diana Stewart Foundation in 2007, when our parents and grandparents encouraged Richard and Diana's six grandchildren to come together to give back to our beloved country. We started out simply by building compassion homes in rural Jamaica. And as the story goes, a senior member of the Food for the Poor team heard about the work we had been doing and invited me to the opening of a basic school constructed by an American family. When I arrived on the site, I was blown away by the scale of the project. I immediately knew that this is what we had to focus our attention on. Early childhood education is a crucial part of a child's journey. And it took us two entire years to fundraise for that very first basic school. But once the horse was out the gate, there was no stopping us. I don't think that back in 2007, I could have dreamed all that we have been able to accomplish in the last 17 years. Kind Hearts Foundation was the very first Jamaican family to donate a basic school in Jamaica with Food for the Poor. We are also the first Jamaican family to build two basic schools back to back, which we did in 2018 when I was eight and a half months pregnant with my second child. <laughs> my daughter Caroline, who has been working very hard with us all weekend. <laughs> Um, in total, we have built eight basic schools, one hospital ward, and donated to countless other projects that have touched the lives of thousands of Jamaicans. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. My grandfather used to tell us, to whom much is given, yeah, much is expected. And my whole life growing up, I have been a part of many, many projects and events, giving back to the less fortunate. But our partnership with Food for the Poor over the last 12 years has been absolutely the most meaningful. And we're already looking forward to our next school next year. It has been our goal since 2012 to build a basic school in every parish. So six down, eight more to go. Yeah! Coming from a family of educators, this cause is close to our heart. And we are excited to do our part by donating an eight kilowatt solar system for the Brixton Hill. And so, and here today, we are here for this handing over. And Christina said it, it was four classrooms, an office, a kitchen, sick bay, bathroom facility for the students and staff. That is significant. So that said, we use this opportunity to thank all those who have contributed to the construction and completion of the building. Special thanks to our donors and volunteers for giving your time, your energy, your sweat equity, we know it has been hard, to provide the new facility and a much improved learning environment for our students. Because of your contribution, a brighter future for our beneficiaries, one infused with purpose and a deep sense of gratitude. In thanking Kind Arts, we also express appreciation to James and Jacqueline Leckler. 
as well as Richard and Diana Stewart for instilling values of kindness and empathy in your children and grandchildren. Yes. The investment is about $21 million. But I have a surprise for you. Every one US dollar you invest in early childhood education, you get back $9. Let us convert that. Food for the poor and the Kind Arts Foundation and the Stewart Foundation have invested approximately $21 million in this facility. If you do the calculation, that's $189 million return on investment that you'll be getting for this facility, minimum. minimum. Not just a return in terms of economic value, but also a return in terms of improving the lives and educational outcomes of another generation of people from this community. Yes. So me have a full me belly while Mary she the fun. <laughs> Richard, do it for the family. Yeah. Why boy can't do it. Done. We are finished. We built a school in 48 hours. Come, let's go check it out. Welcome to the Brixton Hill Infant School. Walk through, courtesy of Top Lodge Limited. I'm gonna be real with you guys. I don't actually know what the rooms are this for. This the bathroom. I'm assuming this would be a bathroom based on the plumbing. Right, yeah. Oh, so let's give them that, guys. So we're assuming that because. You have these pipes here for plumbing, which is most likely a toilet and a sink. We have no idea what contracting is, so sink, toilet. This is Caroline. She's oh. coming with the building. We're leaving her here. Alright, next, let's go to room two. Next room. I also don't know what these rooms are, <laughs> but it looks great. Obviously, it's going to be clean and pretty soon. I'm just going to go ahead and clean that. These are classrooms. I think the big ones are classrooms. You smart. You very smart. <laughs> that would be smart, eh? The big one would be the classroom. Yeah, yeah I, I agree with James. These are probably classrooms. Um, Got a teacher here? You going to work? You going to teach here? Or a parent? 
disappearing. <laughs> yeah, are you happy for the school? Yes, we are elated. Elated. Send a whole heap to marry you. I'm so <laughs> elated. Where is that room? Can I say that? No. I'm really happy for it. Awesome. This is our next classroom. This is where all the lovely kids will be learning. We will be building the foundation of future generations. I want to be a kind channel. Grandkids Initiative, um, the Kind Hearts Foundation. This is what we build our basic schools through. We've done compassion homes in the past. And Christina. Oh, we found the, we found the, the principal. Principal. The Listen, Are you happy for the school? We want to get more donations for more schools. So tell them how good it is. Well, for one, early childhood education is important for the development of any school because for one, the foundation is laid properly. Then the students will do well academically yeah. going up, yes. And of course, we, we have been in dialogue for a number of years to get an early childhood institution, but couldn't get any. Yeah. And the early childhood commission has been coming at us stating that we need a building separated from the main building, which we didn't have. They said we need separate bathroom for the infant department, which we didn't have, but now we have everything now. Awesome. So it is a good thing for the community. Oh. Thank you. I hope you guys love it. Uh, yes, <laughs> love it. <man. laughs> yeah. All right, so. All right, guys. That's it. All we're gone, squad. We're good. Well. We're done. We're going home. The Andrew have him on our social media, so I go put it up on the screen so you can follow and support the little youth. Is it me? Ah. That's your movie camera, Hollywood. Mr. Yes. Eh? Sharp, thank uh, you for everything. Selfie, selfie yes. you're taking all the way. Thank you for everything, Mr. Sharp. Oh, you're welcome. Good man. to thank see you. you. All you're talking about is how much Mr. Sharp has helped Clarendon and helped Jamaica, so really rate that. We got some popsicles together. Hot day, working. You've been working hard. Look at all the paint. You're such a good painter. Cheers. Cheap. Brother, are you eating ice cream or are you painting your face with it? <laughs> Do you know? Show me your right hand. Good job, Amanda. Show me the hardest working manager. Hello? That is the epitome. Do you know where the epitome means? It's the epitome. I just use it. When I first read it. Yo, good job. How is that go? Ah, uh, yo, they're professionals and, and them on the build to make. Big them up every time. So guys, we are at the end of the build. We finished the school in 48 hours, and this school will teach 80 to 90 kids every year for at least the next 15 years. So so amazing. I really want to shout out STL Solar, my um, brethren Daniel Shop and Jason Ball. They're actually donating a solar system to help with energy consumption over here so awesome awesome so guys look at it we, we finished we finished the school in 48 hours amazing all right guys so it's monday we're back to work and the build is finished we finished the school 48 hours to build a school awesome brixton primary that is it just want to say guys really really love this initiative that we do this is our eighth school. And so to give you a little background, growing up, we, my family and I, we've always been into charity. We've always given back. You know, as my grandpa says, or said, rest in peace. Um, to whom much is given, much is um, expected. And so they've always instilled in us that we need to give back. And this was really headed up by my eldest sister, Christina, who is the eldest of the six grandchildren. So our initiative, as grandchildren in accordance with my grandparents foundation we started kind hearts limited and through that guys we have completed eight basic schools in six parishes we have done one hospital ward and four homes in addition to a lot of other donations um, such as like books and such so 
you know, we're really working hard to give back to Jamaica. It's really important to us. We believe in building Jamaica. And if you guys want to help out, you want to know more about it, let me know in the comments down below. And I'll set up like a GoFundMe or I'll find a link where you guys can donate to. Um, every Mikkel Mecca Mokul, you see me? One dollar. One dollar adds up. You see me? So if you want to be a part of a change, if you want a better Jamaica like we do, just let me know. And guys, I hope you enjoy this um, different side of the family, seeing more what we do in our private time. This is something we do a lot. Um, we've been doing this since I was a child, and Kind Hearts has been around like 17 years now. So, 17 sounds, no, 17 sounds way too long. Ross, maybe at least 15 years, to be honest. Oh, no. Holy, we've been doing this a while. So, yeah, if you want to get involved, let me know. Let's do it. Only we can build Jamaica. Only those who love Jamaica and are here, stay and fight for Jamaica, can fix Jamaica. So if you want to be a part of that, let's do it together. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. Later, guys. Remember to like, share, and subscribe.